Well, that's the view out of my window. I'm in Keswick in the Lakes District. We're making a TV show and it is just rainy and it's been rainy for like three days. This is one of the very big frustrations. So I've got some time on my hands because we can't film. Uh, oh, hi. I'm Rick Steves and I'm reporting from North England and this is my beautiful hotel room. Got my uh, closet I've moved in for a few days which is kind of nice. Cleared off from so I can work on my desk by putting my little tea kit on the floor and always a flat screen TV and a nice bathroom and so on and a, a beautiful beautiful bed. Uh, but what I wanted to talk about was my toiletries kit because everybody's got a toiletries kit and People take big ones, and I've got a little tiny ones. So I just wanted to show you this. This is my entire toiletries kit. I've been in Europe now for six weeks, so I'm running. I'm kind of getting down low on things, but uh, this is all I got now. Um, I've got my shampoo. I take it from home, and it's just one tube. One, actually, to be honest, I, I always say, oh, you know, buy your local toiletries, but I bring it from home, and I bring an extra tube in this bag that I keep stored away in my bag, in my big bag. But this is my day-to-day -day toiletries kit. Got my alarm clock, very very handy when we're uh, you don't want to trust the, the hotel call to wake you up or anything like that. And I got my soap dish. I bring my soap from home, and I don't like to use the itsy bitsies all the time, so I don't ever use the itsy bitsies except I open up one for a little soaps there. And then this is the shower soap that I bring from home, and this has been a long trip, so I'm getting kind of low on that. Uh, and then if I look in this little pouch here, I've got my masculine uh, pink comb. I've got my, I want to make my teeth nice, so I've got my Stimudent, and i got my floss, and of course I've got my toothbrush, and uh, I've got my uh, toothpaste, and I'm done to my very end, because in four days I'll be going home, so I've got four days supply of toothpaste left there. Uh, this is my second tube for a six-week trip, and of course you got to shave if you are a shaving type. So I've got my shaver, and you know, you kind of calculate that. I'm down to because I'm done to the last four weeks, four days or so in Europe, I'm done to my very last blade there, clean blade. But that's all my toiletries. Now, to be honest, there's a little bit more that I deep store in my big bag, and I put it in this mesh bag here. And that would be, uh, you know, a Ziploc baggie with my mole skinne or in my or my uh, stuff that I put on if you're getting a blister and your Band-Aid and uh, extra earbuds and suntan lotion, extra business cards if you're a travel writer like me. Um, a little bit of deodorant that I should use, but I don't. Uh, the pills, if you have some pills that you need. If you get calluses on your feet. This is something I bought in here because I'm walking all the time. I get calluses, so grind that out. And I don't bring a lot of pharmaceuticals, but I just like to drop in. I, got, I walked into the door of my car the other day, and my head was bleeding like mad, so I had to stomp that up and went to the pharmacy. But, you know, for a couple dollars in Europe, the pharmaceuticals are really cheap. So that is all of my toiletries. And with that... We can travel happily ever after in Europe. Happy travels, and let's hope it stops raining because we've got a TV show to make. Bye.